A calling game is the lowest ranked game. Basic, lovely, friendly. It is the most common game that is called for in Schafkopf. So again, in every calling game there are 14 trump cards, from the Overa Corn, the strongest trump card, all the way down to the Seven of Heart, the weakest trump card. The regular cards are the Acorns, the Blues, and Shells. Now, in a calling game, the announcing player will select to play either with the player that is holding the Ace of Acorn, or with the player that is holding the Ace of Blue, or with the player that is holding the Ace of Shell. Once the calling game has been announced, two teams are then created. The calling player and the player holding the Ace of the Suit called are the first team. They would need to collect 61 points or more to win. In this round, Billy has called to play with the Blue, which means that Billy will play with the player holding the Ace of Blue. And since we are holding the Ace of Blue in our hand, we will be teaming up with Billy. The other two players who are not holding the ace of the suit called are the second team. So in this round, Tom and Rocky will be teaming up, and they would need to collect 60 or more points to win. Hold on, wait a minute. So who am I playing with? Exactly. We figure that out later on in the game. Only when we see the ace of the suit called in play, we will then know who the teams are. Until that happens, we can only guess. Obviously, only the player that their ace has been called for will know who their teammate is. The other two players that do not have the calling ace will only know that they are not teamed up with the calling player. So here we know right from the start that we are teamed up with Billy because Billy called to play with the Ace of Blue, which we have, but Billy doesn't know that we are teammates at this moment. Tom and Rocky only know that they are not teamed up with Billy since both of them are not holding the Ace of Blue. Three tricks into the game and still Billy, Rocky and Tom don't know for sure who their teammate is. And here on the fourth trick, the Ace of Blue finally comes in play. So only at this point, all the players know who they are teamed up with. There are a few restrictions as to when a player can call a calling game. 1. A player cannot call to play a calling game with a suit if they themselves are holding the ace of that same suit. Let's say we were dealt this hand. With this hand, we are holding the ace of shell, and therefore, we cannot call shell. 2. The player must hold at least one non-ace regular card of the suit they are calling for. So back to the hand. We are not holding any acorns, and therefore, we cannot call a corn. 3. The player cannot call heart, even though they might have a heart. Heart is trump. So if we were to announce a game, we would only be able to call blue. Now the player holding the ace of the suit called can't just lay down that ace anytime they want to. A player can only lay down that ace calling card in three situations. 1. When the trick starts with a regular card holding the suit called for, the calling ace must be laid down. So Rocky is announcing a calling for shell. Billy started the trick with seven shell. Now right there, when it's our turn, we can't lay down this 8 shell, nor any other card. It is not even an option. We have to lay down the ace shell calling card. 2. 
the player has the option to lay down the calling ace card when and if they start a trick. Let's bring this back to the start. Bailey, go ahead. Okay. We have collected the first trick. And now we can lay down the ace shell calling card to start off the trick. But only if we wish. This is a legal move. And last, if the first and second situations have not played out in the first seven tricks, we are left with laying down the calling ace card on the last trick of the game. Laying down the ace calling card in any other in play situations is an illegal move. Now let's go ahead and watch a full calling game. In this game, we will have the start button and start the action. We were dealt a nice decent hand. We will decide to play. Billy, Rocky and Tom passed. And we will call for the shell. Obviously, we can't call a corn since we are holding the ace, and we cannot call blue, since we are not holding any blue regular cards. And we start the game with a trump. All the others must lay a trump. Tom takes the first trick. Is he our teammate? And Tom just laid the first shell regular card. He is probably not our teammate. Let's see if someone lays the calling ace. And there is our teammate right there, Billy. Billy starts the next trick with a trump. Very nice. Here is 10 more eyes for us. Tom is out of trumps. We'll have to take down this trick. Looks like Rocky is also out of trumps. Oh! Tom just took 25 eyes. And they'll take 14 more. Let's count and see who won. So here on the left are all the valuable cards we and Billy have collected this game. Sevens, eights, and nines aren't worth anything, therefore, they are not on here. So let's sum it up. We got three aces times 11 eyes each ace is 33 eyes. Two tens times 10 eyes each 10 is 20 eyes. Two kings times four eyes each king is eight eyes. Four overs times three eyes each over is twelve eyes. And last, we got four unders times two eyes each under is eight eyes. Altogether, we and Billy have collected eighty-one eyes. Our first Schafkopf win. On the right side are all the valuable cards that Rocky and Tom have collected. We can obviously calculate 120 minus 81 to find out how much they have collected, but we will calculate anyways. Ace is 11, plus 2 tens is 31, plus 2 kings is 39. Now let's continue filling out the scorecard. A calling game raid is 20 points or 20 cents. Schneider is a bonus of 10 points if the game is won by over 90 eyes. But we didn't get a Schneider. Schwartz is a bonus of 20 points if all the tricks and the eyes were collected by the winning side. But we didn't get a Schwartz either. 
straight bonuses, the placement bets, contra, and tout, or do, it is pronounced do, I will explain about all that in a later video. But we didn't have any straight placement bets, contra, or do this past round. So in total, we and Billy have each won 20 points. In return, Tom and Rocky lost 20 points. Tom would then give us 20 of his points, and Rocky will give Billy 20 of his points. <laughs>